Hey there, my name is Jean Lim, product specialist here at ENM, and today we're talking about and showing the demo in six newest 2D LiDAR scanner, the Pico Scan. The successor to the Tim Area Scanner, the Pico Scan brings in more power and more capability in a frame just as small as the Tim, offering high performance in both indoor and harsh outdoor conditions. While its working concept is the same, the PicoScan is a vast improvement since the Tim has been released to the market, offering triple the performance in the same size and form factor. You can get scanning ranges of up to 120 meters and angular resolution down to 0.05 degrees, a 15 Hz scanning frequency at its fastest configuration, and high quality measurement data for precise localization processing. The PicoScan also includes a multitude of echo filtering capabilities alongside six patented HDDM Plus technology to help reduce false trips and take in high quality data in rugged outdoor environments. For those unaware of what HDDM Plus is, six LiDAR scanners employ a large burst of small laser pulses within each angular resolution to create an average distance measurement at that resolution. Mist, fog, weld sparks, and dust can be ignored thanks to this technology, making it the most reliable 2D LiDAR scanner in the market. The PicoScan employs a modular system plug technology to alleviate exchange of devices. If this scanner gets broken, but the system plug at the back is safe, all you do is attach this system plug into a new scanner, and that new scanner would be configured exactly like your old one. And when it comes to setup, the browser-based Sophos Air interface eliminates the need for any supplemental software to configure and diagnose the scanner. Generally, the PicoScan is great for indoor mobile robots, but it really excels in reliability and performance for outdoor guided vehicles. Let's showcase a specific use case for it. Outdoor localization and detection using the PicoScan's reflector detection mode. Alrighty, so now we're outside. We're in the great outdoors of the e and Pacific Northwest parking lot. And here I have set up my PicoScan for an outdoor demo. So check this out. I have my PicoScan right here. It's hooked up to a battery in my car. On my laptop, I actually have uh, the PicoScan Sopus Air interface. And if you get on the eye line of that PicoScan, you'll see a white little tower right all the way over there, 40 meters away. That is gonna be, that is our test uh, reflector rod. Um, I just have some reflector tape um, on a cylindrical box. And right now I have the PicoScan running to detect the area around it and see if it'll pick it up as a reflector right all the way over there. Okay, so now we have that rolling. As you can see here on our screen right here, we have the Pico scan right here at the center. And as you see all the way 40 meters away, right around here, that's where that test rod is at. As you can see, there are other things that the Pico scan is registering as reflectors. And if you go back over, if I show you a quick view of the area again, we see some cars with some really good reflective shine on them. So those little, those little areas that are showcasing as reflectors are actually cars. They have really good, um, you know, the painting coating, the paint coating of cars are actually really good. So that's why they register as reflectors. As you can see over here, and with that, that's a, that's a quick look on how the Pico Scan works outdoors. So thank you so much for your time. Uh, if you have any questions or if you have anything else you'd like to learn about with the Pico Scan, feel free to contact me. My name is Jean Lim. Again, I'm the sick product specialist for E&M. And thank you so much. And we appreciate, we appreciate you watching this video. Bye-bye.